Intraortic balloon pumps have been used for many years to provide support during cardiogenic shock. They augment diastolic filling pressure by expanding in the aorta during diastole. In addition, they may increase cardiac output slightly by decreasing afterload with deflation during systole. In general, they provide about 1 to 2 liters a minute of augmented cardiac output. Percutaneous ventricular assist devices have been developed more recently to provide more flow to support cardiac output, up to several liters per minute. Cardiopulmonary bypass is able to completely replace the function of the heart and lungs. However, it's generally available only in the operating room environment. Extracorporeal membranous oxygenation, or ECMO devices, are able to provide biventricular support at flow rates which may be adequate to provide perfusion, and have been described as a supportive therapy for patients in cardiac arrest as a bridge toward intervention or recovery. These devices function in a similar manner to cardiopulmonary bypass, but are more portable and therefore more available for use in the emergency setting. It's important to remember that mechanical circulatory support provides temporary support as a bridge for patients in whom an endpoint is clear. For example, a disease process in which recovery is expected or definitive treatment is available. Examples may include cardiac revascularization, recovery from a transient disease process like some types of myocarditis, or recovery from a toxic overdose, or as a bridge to organ transplantation. Patients are unlikely to benefit from these therapies if they have multi-organ system failure, irreversible conditions or terminal diseases, or with any other contraindications like the inability to anticoagulate. So I hope you liked this video. Absolutely make sure to check out the course this video was taken from and to register for a free trial account which will give you access to selected chapters of the course. If you want to learn how MetMastery can help you become a great clinician, make sure to watch the About MetMastery video. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you again soon.